All right, I'm just going to underarm them. I'm going to vary my pace as well and the line of length. I just want you getting down, hard sweep. If you want to sort of practice hitting different areas by the line or by manipulating where your leg goes, that's fine. Get your head forward, head still, and I want a nice full swing of the bat. Right glove by your left ear. Ah, good start, but finish that swing off. Good, good. Well done, excellent. That was really full, well, well adjusted. Weight was back there. Good. Nice shot. Finish your swing off. Lovely head position. Head still. Hold well on. Finish your swing. Head's good. Hold well on. Probably try and hit that. Rather than try and get it round the square, because it's wider, just go more mid-wicket. The Indians talk about 90 degrees to the ball, wherever it is. You're not trying to go round the back of the ball. Follow through. It's just, you're just placing it. I want you to hit it. Good. Well done. Well weighted. Good boy. Nice shot. Good. Yeah, try and that's why I want you to get finished. Right club by left ear. Well played. Shot boy. Well watched, well watched. Good. Okay, you can bring in, do, do six reverses. Good. Ah, bad throw. Bad. Good. Two more. Yep. Does he actually have to hit it? Yep. Rather than outside off, you mean? Yeah. Good. I reckon, and everyone does it differently. I think Maxwell does what you do, but for me personally, when I reverse, what helps me is trying to keep my distance that the bat has to move a bit smaller. So you're going high, and then you have to come all the way down to the ball. I try and just get my hands here and then just sweep from there, like from that, and I'm just going lower. You'll probably get more power and you probably can hit sixes like Maxwell does from up here, but there's more that can go wrong when you're downswing. Yeah. Does that make sense? Something just to keep playing with. I, I, I can't also reverse. I don't think you're doing reverse often. Yeah. Because when you're leggy, you've got to create a large container there. Yeah. And you can't have to, you have to make it. You have to m force the pace, you mean? Yeah. Because it's obvious, just like, you've yeah. got to hit the outside of the line. Right? Yeah. You just kind of let it run. Like, yeah. And again, it's all field related. You don't, you wouldn't really play if you don't need to. Okay, we've got about 20 or so balls. I'm going to give you two gaps, okay? Two gaps. I want you to try and hit boundaries with your sweeps. But it could be um, third man's a gap and square leg's a gap. Could be mid-wicket's a gap and um, backward square leg's a gap. Could be cover points a gap. And I want you to sweep everything. Try and hit one of the two gaps I give you. Okay, so we'll start with 45, like fine leg, really fine, and deep forward point. So you've got to try and find the gap. Oh, you got it. All right, deep square and um, 45 on the offside. Same, same gaps. Good, on square, good. Okay, mid wicket and deep backward square, the gaps. Probably got it a bit square. What happened there? Uh, that's a sausage roll thing from this morning. <laughs> 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 I thought 
something had fallen out of your gear. Off your gear. All right. Um, backward point. Backward square leg. Good. Didn't get a boundary though. Uh, on square in front of point. Good effort. It's all right. It's what this is about. On square mid wicket. Tough one. No, you're not. Just relax. Process the information, then play the shot. I haven't said anything yet. Uh, deep backward square and fine on the offside. It's all right. Come on. Switch on. Forward square leg and fine on the offside. There we go. Beautiful shot. Okay, mid wicket and backward point. Well done. Good boy. Backward square and forward point. Well done. You're just a bit more focused now. 45 on both sides. Well done. Got it there. No boundary, but got it there. 45 offside, um, deep backward square. It's all right. Okay. Um, mid wicket, um, deep backward square. Yeah, not bad. Okay, I want these last six all to go on, on square, on the leg side. Try and hit boundaries through, pass the umpire. Good. Good, your gaps are right on square leg. Follow through. Okay, you needed to get your leg across to get it to square leg because it was outside off. Yes, good boy, one more. Well done, all right, good. Plenty of work to do there, but just got to keep practicing it. And good sweepers hit the ball to where the fielders aren't, and they do it often to get the field changed. So if we can open up lots of different sweep shots all the way around the ground, you become so hard to bowl to. <laughs> all right, get them in, and we'll drag this turf top up. All right. Get this turf top crank and see what we've got. No, uh, yep, four are meant to knit a little bit and two a lot. I reckon that's about the length. We'll go fraction back this way. No, it would be quite full. Gotta go this way a bit. All right, I reckon that's pretty good. A little bit puffy here. All right, so it won't be super quick, but they might do a bit, so you gotta watch the ball, okay? Really good challenge this. Using the turf top. Uh, first time I've really used it, something Great little training aid. Let's have a look how it goes. All right, this is gonna be challenging. You gotta uh, watch it hard. Do you want a bit? Oh yeah, how's the pace? Do you want it any quicker? Fraction quicker? Looks a fraction slow. Oh. Okay, so that's where this is going to be awesome practice. You've just got to be side on. You sort of came right across that ball. Okay, good challenge this. It was a seed. Find a way. Good. Can't practice like it's easy all the time. That should be coming to me. Well done. Yeah, I reckon it's all right. Well, as he said, you had him on it yesterday. Okay, that foot's pretty close there, not, and you're overstriding a little. Can't get round your pad. Well 
Well done, well done. Watch it all the way. Good boy. Fully commit. Yes, brilliant. Well done. See it when you're defending, no wider than mid off. Excellent. Good boy. Take your time. Yeah? Okay, one well that's coming straighter. Oi, well bowled, Scalzi. Is that not out? Nah, outside the line. Look where your head is. Okay, you're sort of planting across. That's what we watched on the video last week. So you're a bit worried about the movement and you're going here, planting, and then you're playing with your hands out, just your foot's not moving and playing out in front of your pad. Got to be here, wait, 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 and then move to where the ball is. Uh, I'm not sure, I'll tell you. I'll find out. Good, mate. Good. Better position. It came straight. You didn't close yourself off. Okay, sorted out. Head. Well done. Well adjusted. Good. Excellent. What did you say you got used to? Good. Well done. Coming straighter. Good boy. Excellent. Heaps better. Good. That stayed low. Well done, well done. Watching it all the way. Try and sit in your heels a bit more. That's good. Better position. Just closing yourself off that front foot. Well bowled. Hey mate, last six. 
No. Proper, sh proper shot. You said you don't want to hit a ball in the air. How are you, mate? Good. Well done. Well done. Not bad. Not bad. Still going a bit too much. Good, two more. Oh, bowling skulls eat. Last one. Oh, yes. What do you reckon of it? Good practice? Just means it's a bit more realistic then. Yeah. Looks like it's challenging. Yeah. Can't just plonk on the front foot. Good leave. Oh, well done. That's all right, that's a seed. That's what this is about. Oh! Good leave. Huh? Yeah, sort of just over off stump. Good leave. Keep trying to get into the ball with your weight. Oh, bowling skulls. Turning him round. Better. Stop that head from going. Oh, bowling skulls. Oh, yes. Ready? Turning him round. Well done. Solid. All right, let's move it and let's just bat normally for the last 10 minutes.